Okay. Strokes are a medical emergency that can happen anytime, day or night, which is why UPMC Altoona has a new program to provide a more advanced stroke treatment 24 7. Our Jack McCune spoke with experts at the medical center to ask what makes the treatment faster and potentially more effective. UPMC Altoona has offered an advanced stroke surgery for four years, but now the medical center becomes one in a few hundred in the country that can offer it 24 7 after its new certification that's doubled the amount of procedures being done. Over the last year, I was, I was doing one or two of these thrombectomy procedures a week. Uh, in the last two weeks, I did eight of them. It's called mechanical thrombectomy. Chief of Neurology, Dr. Cynthia Kenmere, says it's a faster surgery for treating ischemic strokes because it removes the blood clot causing the stroke rather than trying to dissolve it or break it up like with IV treatment. Large clots rarely break up with that IV medicine. She can go in and take that blood clot out and she's basically handing them back parts of their life that they wouldn't have had. Sometimes patients actually get better on the table. So they can go from not talking, not moving their whole right side, so we take the clot out and all of a sudden they say, hey, where am I? What's going on? Uh, and they start moving around. We kind of reassure them they're in the hospital. Everything's going to be OK. Kenmer says like any other type of brain surgery, there are potential risks like internal bleeding. So if the patient's symptoms go away after IV treatment, she doesn't recommend the procedure. However, if, if a patient still has symptoms, it's probably worth the risk of going in there because they are going to have this permanent disability. You lose about 2 million neurons, 2 million brain cells every single minute in a stroke. And she says the most important thing to do to treating stroke is recognizing the signs and going to a hospital immediately. I'm Jack McCune for WTAJ News.